ClickUp versus Monday, best project management software. Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you everything you need to know about ClickUp and Monday.com and which one is the better project management software for you. So let's get into it. First off, I'm going to be showing you the spaces on both of these project management software. So I'm going to show you the overall dashboards of ClickUp and Monday.com. And then I am going to move on to their pricing and what kind of different plans to, that they offer. So this is the uh, home space of ClickUp. And over here, it's my basic homepage. Over on the left, I have my different workspaces. And if I go into here, I have this template that I used, this ClickUp template. You can see over here, this is my ClickUp template that I've used, and it's a pretty nice template. The overall look of ClickUp is quite appealing. It has a good organization. You can see I have a basic list, and within that, I have different subcategories. Now, a good part about ClickUp is that you can click on a task and you can add as much detail as you want. So you can see over here, there is the cost, hours, location, payment status, progress, rate, service, and type. All of these details you can add to your ClickUp project. You can also take your notes and add them over here as well in the form of documents over here and then collect all of your documents within a list onto your view board. So you can see all of the notes together and that's really helpful if you're in a management category as well. So that is something to keep in mind. These are some of the great features that ClickUp provides. Overall, Monday.com is pretty similar, but we're going to get to that in a minute. Now over here, you can see your different workspaces, your settings. So this is my team one and my Lisa account. And this is my basic account. So if I go into any of this, I'm going to be changing the settings of my account only. And if I go into here, I'm going to be changing the settings of my workspace. And you can see your basic list views. You have board views over here. You can see this is a board view. Then you have your scheduling on your calendar. Then you have your docs. So all of your little notes that any of your creators or your uh, workers have made, you, you can view them over here. Then you can have your service requests and so on and so forth. ClickUp also provides you with timeline views and in general, it provides you with a bunch of features. It also has automations, but uh, it's usually provided to only paid versions of ClickUp. You're not going to get automations on free ClickUp, but you can get it if you're paying for the ClickUp premium service or the premium version of ClickUp. Now, moving on to Monday.com. So you can see it looks pretty similar. And you can see over here, you have your workspace, you have different lists and within the lists, you have your tasks. If you click on a task, you're going to get the detailed information about the task. You can write updates, you can add a view as well. And I think the overall detailed version of their task system is not as good as ClickUp is because if I click on a task, I want to know everything about it but it, it feels a bit lackluster when you compare it to ClickUp. But in general, if you actually look at the view over here, it does provide you with enough information so you can see the person that it, it has been assigned to, what the current status of the task is, when is the due date, and what is the timeline of the task. So that is something that this um, template has provided. Monday.com also has timeline views, table views, calendar views and everything else that ClickUp does provide. It also has integrations, basic integrations, the same as ClickUp. You can see you can create different workspaces for uh, different projects that you're running or different organizations that you're working in. So you can create separate workspaces for each of those. And on the left, you have your general notifications, you have your inbox, you have your my work section. Then you have your apps, you have your invite members, you have your search everything, you have help and your general account settings. So over here, you can just view your own account and your own personal details. If you go back into our workspaces over here, so you can see we have all of our details over here. And the thing I don't like about monday.com is how overwhelming their workspace can look like. So when I 
enter their workspace it feels like it's so much information just being thrown at me like i want to close this sidebar and you can see it's good that if it provides you with so much information but at the same time maybe if you're a manager or if you're just someone that monitors the progress this might feel a bit overwhelming and you might want to create a separate dashboard only to monitor your progress now that was it for the general looks of both of these project management softwares it totally depends on you as well maybe you like this kind of look and you like these kinds of details maybe you like the sleeker look provided by ClickUp that's something that is up to you I am going to move on to the pricing on both of these project management softwares so first off we have ClickUp and ClickUp really does keep it simple just like their workspaces. They just have two basic plans and then they have an enterprise version and you can really uh, ask them about it if you want or um, you can get their deals over here. You can click on over here and you can add how large your company might be and ask them what kind of pricing you can afford and get in touch with them, get in contact and negotiate a deal for your team. Now on the free version of ClickUp, they have this very, really nice, flexible feature about being free forever. That is their policy. They, they're going to provide this service for free, all of these basic services. So ClickUp has over 100 MBs of file storage for you if you're using the free version. You also get unlimited tasks, unlimited members. So you have the option to add as many people as you like to your ClickUp account or your workspace even if you're using the free version and that is something that is a huge 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 plus point for ClickUp. you won't get that in monday.com and you're going to be pretty disappointed once you view the limitations that monday.com has on their free version you also get two-factor authentication on the free version and this is overall a very nice deal by ClickUp. you get unlimited storage on your unlimited version of ClickUp and that is per member per month so you have to keep in mind each person on your team is going to be paying five dollars if they're paying yearly if they're paying monthly they're going to be paying nine dollars so overall if you go for the yearly version you're going to be saving three dollars a month uh, which is a lot of money if you estimate the long-term value of such products is best if you pay it yearly because it's not going to amount to that much and the utility of the product really does exceed its price you get unlimited list board and calendar views you get unlimited integrations and that's very nice of ClickUp. you can integrate as many uh, different softwares that you're using so if you're using any uh, third-party um, web developers if you're using any third-party um, website builders third-party uh, shop builders so it, that's something very important if you're using shopify or equid you can integrate that over here as well you get unlimited dashboards guests and permissions so you can add as many read only guests so these are going to be guests that can only view the project but they can't edit anything and that's very good if you want to have your Maybe if you're working with some clients and you want them to monitor your progress but not interfere or hinder with it, they can do that as well. Also, you have your goals, portfolios, and custom fields. And that's something very helpful if you're running a business or a company. And when it gets larger, it's going to get difficult to keep track of all, all of your goals, your different employee progress. If an employee is being more productive, what have they been up to, what kind of general progress they have made, you can monitor all of that in their portfolio now moving on to the monday.com price plans now monday.com really does make this a whole lot more complicated first off they do have a free version now previously monday.com did not have a free version at all but they have created a free version now and this will only allow you up to two seats so that's it if you're two members in your company you can use the free version of monday.com if you're any more than that you're gonna have to purchase a premium version of monday.com and that is a huge 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 limitation in terms of workability and general flexibility of monday.com 
Obviously, you get unlimited boards and docks, but what's really the use of having unlimited docks and boards when only two people are using it? It's it's just not something you're going to end up doing. And if you're, you're starting out with project management softwares, I would definitely suggest starting off with ClickUp. And then if you don't like ClickUp, then moving on to Monday.com or any other project manager rather than starting off with Monday.com and just upgrading it directly. You get over 20 column types, two team members, iOS and Android updates. Now, uh, ClickUp also has a mobile app that you can use to get your Android and iOS updates as well. And that's a feature that is so that is expected of any project manager that they did not even bother to mention it because it's just a feature that is a accessory. It's not a total feature to actually even mention that monday.com has mentioned over here now monday.com also has their eight dollar basic program ten dollar standard and a sixteen dollar pro and then you can negotiate for the enterprise version of monday.com as well and set a deal with monday.com now the i'm going to compare the standard version that is ten dollars per seat per month uh, and uh, per seat per month means per person per month so each member is going to be paying ten dollars and it will include a basic timeline and gantt views calendar views guest access you will get 250 actions per month in terms of automations you get 250 actions per month in terms of integration so you're not going to even get unlimited integrations that you get with ClickUp, and you're going to create a dashboard that can combine up to five boards so if you are working and all of a sudden you need to uh, mix all of your projects together if uh, there has been a overlap in your projects you need to mix them all together that can also be done on monday.com now, in the general basic version, you have only five gigabytes of file storage, which is very less because ClickUp is going to be providing you with unlimited file storage in only their $5 plan. So the, in $8, they're not even going to be providing you that as well. And you can only create a dashboard based on one board. So you can't really combine boards in the $8 version of Monday. In general, now to add my own opinions, you might think I'm biased, but I really do prefer ClickUp over Monday.com. I think Monday.com is going to be a huge waste of money for anyone that is starting out or anyone that even is looking to purchase Monday.com. It's still not a good deal for the amount of money that it has. It's not going to give you a lot of the good features, the basic features that are going to be essential for your business. They're going to be lacking on monday.com. Sure, they're going to give you good formula columns or time tracking, or maybe they'll combine your dashboards, but that is really useless if you don't have enough storage to keep your files, if you don't have spaces if you don't have custom views if you don't have the basic essentials of adding guests that's gonna be all gone down the drain if you purchase monday.com and you're like oh i have these advanced features but it lacks the basic building blocks that are required of any project management software so in general for my thoughts i think clickup is a winner by a landslide and money.com is just for someone that is trying it out. And even if you're just trying it out, you're going to move on to click up anyways. So that was just my views and thoughts. And I hope you guys found this video helpful and I will catch you guys in the next video.